choosing a residency, you get all kinds of advice from different people about how to strategically pick a program based on your career goals. The best advice that I got was to pick a place that feels like home. That between the long hours and the late nights and the calls, the people you do residency with would become like your family over time. And I think when I interviewed here, I felt immediately that Geisinger is that place and our internal medicine residency is that program. I had the opportunity to come here as a sub-on and um, obviously, you know, kind of see the inner workings of Geisinger, um, see the close-knit community the residents have here, see the support of the residents, um, you know, in such a big tertiary academic te teaching institution, um, and I was very impressed. I actually heard about Geisinger when I was an undergrad at Elizabethtown College, which is about an hour and a half from here. I used to drive by the hospital and I said, someday I'm going to work there. So when I got the interview, I was ecstatic. I was very impressed by the residents and the staff that I met here during my interview and I could tell that this was going to be a program where I was going to grow and learn and take care of a lot of really sick people. Coming into town uh, for the first time, it was night and you could see the hospital looming on top of the hill, and I could just tell this was something special. The faculty and the administration, they made you feel very at home the second you walked in the door. I had never rotated here, so my interview day was my first time on campus. Immediately, everyone was super welcoming, super warm to me. I mean, I could generally tell that people enjoyed coming here, enjoyed working together, and enjoyed coming to work every day, and that was very, very appealing to me. I already am in residency. I've had so many different experiences and different subspecialties that I actually didn't consider before coming here. Um, so it's really just opened my eyes to different things that I didn't think of before. I saw that um, you know previous classes has, had matched into not just great fellowships at Geisinger but outside of the system as well. So that was kind of a clear indication to me that the teaching and you know, the research opportunities must go above and beyond to be able to support these residents into matching into these fellowships. Since working at Geisinger, my goals um, were to become a very good clinician and follow my dreams of becoming a cardiologist. And I think Geisinger has prepared me very well as I go through the process of the fellowship um, to become that good clinician. I think being a great internist and being a good hospital doctor has prepared me well to take that next step. One thing that I did not realize I was good at or I was um, interested in is it was being an educator and having the access to interns and medical students from different medical schools gave me that opportunity to be a better teacher and by that I became a better provider myself. Um, so one goal that I've developed since starting at Guy Center is actually in education. I'm part of the clinician educator track um, which focuses on educating us as residents on how to be better educators towards our fellow residents, medical students. Um, so that's something that I never previously thought that I would be interested in, but since starting at Geisinger, um, it's something that I've become passionate about and hope to incorporate into my future career. I've really enjoyed living over here. I think that Central Pennsylvania has this charm, which is very delightful. People here are very, very warm and welcoming. And I think that being in this area, it provides you with a great opportunity to, to focus on your career um, and at the same time find yourself. I love living in Central Pennsylvania. Um, the fact that the mountains are right here in my backyard, I have the Susquehanna River right down the road for me beautiful scenery, uh, farmland, um, friendly neighbors, um, it's just a great place to live. For me it reminds me of home. One of my favorite parts is just how easy living here is. Um, my commute is less than five minutes every day, um, which saves me a lot of time and there's always plenty of things to do in the area between different fairs and festivals, restaurants, there's always something to do. So one of the nice things about being in Central Pennsylvania is that you really get to experience all of the seasons. You have your sunny days, you can go out and boat down the river. Um, in the fall, you get to see the changing of the leaves. There's plenty of farms and wineries to go pumpkin picking, go through corn mazes, 
and then in the winter you get to do the fun winter activities. So there's plenty of places to go skiing, snowboarding, or snow tubing. So there are numerous uh, different sporting activities that you can do, such as golf. We have a Frosty Valley uh, golf course. Uh, it's beautiful and also has a nice venue for food and uh, just hanging out throughout the day. You, we have different basketball leagues. Um, I have an adult league, which is quite fun, entertaining. Uh, there's a soccer league around that's an indoor um, throughout the winter that we'll play. And there is mountain biking that we have trails for hiking and biking. Something that my dad calls Danville is like the center of the world because it's basically like a hub of all the major northeastern cities. So DC, New York City, Philly, um, if you want to go up north, Montreal, Boston. So it's really great if you want to do an extended weekend or even a day trip to the, to the closer cities. I've come with a wife and kids from California and it's very different but we really like how safe it is. We've already found great community here. Uh, my wife is super involved with a bunch of other ladies here. She's made great friends and has lots to do. I've already gone, you know, like whitewater canoeing. I've, you know, been able to do some biking. So it's really fun. There's lots to do here. There's tons to do for, for families. Uh, we're busy every weekend with both of my daughters. Uh, we do a lot of hiking. I do a lot of mountain biking myself, fishing, canoeing, kayaking. We just, we love the family friendly and atmosphere here. Just people are kind, people say hello to each other and walking down the street. It's safe and uh, I really couldn't ask for a better place to raise my family. The residents really are quite a close-knit group. All of the classes get along well with each other. Um, they function well as a team, both here at work as well as outside of work. Um, there's always somebody having a get-together or a barbecue or a holiday party. Um, and I think it's really nice that everybody is able to support each other outside of work as well. Geisinger is a great place to work. It is a place that's focused on the future of medicine. It puts its caretakers and physicians first and really is focused on value-based medicine and community medicine to help and improve the health and lives of people everywhere and especially here in Central Pennsylvania. It's an amazing place to get to know people, to treat complex medical conditions, uh, and really to become um, part of a close-knit community, a very supportive community, a community that cares.